Salve, Dartonians, and welcome back to The Wandering LARPer. As always, I'm your host, Salvatore. On tonight's episode of The Wandering LARPer, we are going to be reviewing Epic Armory's new foam, the Stronghold line. We're going to get uh, into these swords, we're going to give you all the specs, let you know how they handle in combat, how safe they are for American LARPs, and everything else. So without further ado, let's jump right into the episode. Epic Armory has released a new line of foam they have dubbed the Stronghold Collection. Um, the swords are really great. Like everything Epic Armory, these are designed by LARPers for LARPers. They're highly engineered to be safe. They're magnificent swords. The uh, detail on them is so much more high resolute than Epic Armory has ever done before. The actual sword feels more like a Kalamaseal foam, yet it feels a lot safer and uh, more durable than Kalamaseal. Because like I said, Epic Armory is made by LARPers for LARPers. The details in the pommel and handle are magnificent. The bounce back, there's not a lot of whip on these. They handle excellently. Um, everything in the construction feels sturdy and top notch. Uh, everything on the pommels feels like it's not going to break from repeated combat. Now, the only drawback of these weapons is um, Epic Armory is still stating that you do need the silicon spray to maintain these. They really don't feel like it. And since I've gotten them, I haven't silicon sprayed them yet. I've used them for a couple of weeks and they're really holding up magnificently. Uh, I took these out sparring and I really fell in love with the line. I can't recommend them enough. And like I said, everything Epic Armory, it's majority times going to pass every American uh, LARP safety inspection. So it's a sure bet for a great weapon for years to come and not just going to be a cabin hanger. Let's take a closer look at some of these swords. These swords are awesome. Epic Armory spared no expense or time in design to make these swords look fantastic, durable, safe, and ready to LARP with. These are amazing LARP weapons. Now with an average cost going between uh, $120 and uh, $95 plus shipping for one of these swords, they're well worth it. Um, the style and look of them lend themselves to so many different characters. You're not going to be disappointed going for this line. Um, I'd love to have more of them. Uh, my sponsor sent me three. I want the rest of the line now. I may go out with my own money and buy them. They're that cool. I just want to have them maybe for my monster town at Nero, South Carolina. Either way, I highly recommend these swords. I love most everything Epic Armory does. Um, if you're not familiar with the line, you have Renee and you have Patrick. That's the uh, division out in Europe with Renee. The division in Canada is Patrick. These guys are real LARPers. They love the sport. They're awesome guys. They run a great company. I can't recommend them enough. Um, customer service wise, LARPer satisfaction, these guys will jump through hoops for you. They actually love the community and I love to support them. Go out and buy some of these Stronghold foam swords from Epic Armory. You're gonna love them. And until the next LARP, 